and I'm at the Eka Animal Nursery because I love animals. Let's head inside and see them now. Ali, Queen of the Animal Nursery. Hey Oliver, hey everyone, welcome today. Thank you for coming to visit. Ali, there's so many animals here, where do they all come from? They come from about five different farms around Queensland, as close as 40 minutes and as far as the border of New South Wales and Queensland. I got to ask, do you like animals as much as I do? Yes, I love animals. So I've been doing this pretty much my whole life, for just 23 years. That's how long we've been coming to the animal nursery, me and my family. So uh, these, these little guys are pretty much family as well. So I have to ask you, what's your favourite animal? My favourite animal would probably be an axolotl. An axolotl, that's not a farm animal. But it's still an animal. <laughs> <laughs> We've got a few goats here, and they've been known to make some pretty strange noises. Yeah. They do make some funny noises, but they also do love to play. So baby goats and baby sheep tend to do a little, uh, what we call like a flick and they will flip their whole body and jump off logs and, and play around. All these animals are really amazing, but do you have any special or unique ones here? Yeah, so we actually do have a couple of uh, special ones. So we have two sheep called Wallace and Gromis, and they are black-nosed valet sheep, so they're the only two in Queensland. And the other really cool animals that we have are our two Scottish Highland cows. And they have big horns and they are also only 18 months old, but they are very special cows. Thank you, Ali, for sharing all these amazing animals with us. Thanks for coming today, Oliver. And uh, if you guys are down at the Echo, make sure you come visit us at the Animal Nursery. Fun fact, geese have teeth. Donkeys can live up to 35 years. A dog's nose print is one of a kind, just like a fingerprint. Llamas don't have hooves, they just have two big toes. Do you guys know what a sheep's favourite treat is? A chocolate bar. Thank you so much everyone for hanging out at the Eka Animal Nursery. Now let's catch up with Laura and Belinda in Sideshow Alley. Hi guys, I'm Laura and I'm Belle and today we're here at the Brisbane Echo and we're going to give you a ride review. Today we're going to go on three rides and rate them on a series of categories. I'm pretty good with speed, but I don't know about when it goes upside down. I just don't like it when it starts spinning too fast. Are you ready to do this? Let's go! First up is the giant slide. It's eight lanes of fast and furious fun. Race you to the top! your friends, so I give it a 2 out of 10. Height wise, it was pretty high, but it wasn't very stomach dropping, so I give it a 3 out of 10. For speed, it was okay, depends how hard you can push, but overall I'd give it a 5 out of 10. For stomach churn, I feel completely fine. Same, 1 out of 10. Time to find our next ride to review. Go on 
here, so brave faces on. Uh, can I still hold your hands? for others. We rate this a 7 out of 10. Height-wise, this was pretty high. I think I could see our house from here, and we live like an hour away. We rate it an 8 out of 10. This ride was way faster than the giant slide. We rate it a 7 out of 10. I still feel pretty sick, and it's been like 10 minutes. So I'm gonna rate this a 7 out of 10 with the stomach churner. Time to find our third and final ride. <laughs> in multiple different ways. For speed, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. Stomach-wise, I'm feeling a little dizzy still, so I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Hey, 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 it wasn't that bad. There you have it, folks, and this is just the tip of the iceberg of all the fun that you can have with this year's Eka. So if you get the chance, come on down to Slideshow Alley and experience all the fun yourself. This is Belle and Laura. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Do you want to go on another ride? Yeah, let's go. It's time to play Becca, this or that. Strawberry Sunday or a daggle dog. Definitely strawberry Sunday. They're so, so delicious. Definitely a strawberry Sunday. The Eka is iconic for their Sundays. I would choose a daggle dog with tomato sauce. Strawberry Sunday. A strawberry Sunday because it's sweet and yummy. Looks like there's nothing sweeter than a strawberry Sunday. Sideshow Alley Games, all the rides. Obviously the rides, they're so fun, aren't they? Ooh, definitely the rides. I do love a good horror house though. I would choose a Sideshow Alley because I can win heaps of prizes from it. Games with duckies. Rides. Looks like there's plenty of thrill seekers who love their rides. Chop a chop show bag or Cadbury chocolate show bag. Cadbury chocolate show bag, yummy. Ooh, definitely Chubba Chops. I love Chubba Chops. Chocolate is probably second best, I think, yeah. Cadbury chocolate show bag. Chocolate. Chubba Chop, because I like lollipops and stuff. We need more Chocky bags, it's a popular choice. Animal nursery or the sheep shearing. You know I'm gonna pick the petting zoo. I love animals. Oh, I definitely love pets, so I would definitely go to the petting zoo. I love chickens, so I would definitely be at the petting zoo to hold them and pet them. Sharing the sheep. The petting zoo? I love animals. <laughs> Who doesn't love adorable animals? That's all we've got time for today on Eka This or That. Bye!